This is a story of Christmas, of a man, Ebenezer Scrooge, who hated Christmas, but learned to love it, or rather, was taught to love it. Nobody liked Scrooge. He was a mean old man. He loved no one and he gave nothing. He despised merriment and happiness. He was as cold as the cold grave. One Christmas Eve, Scrooge was given a chance to change, a chance to live. Will he take it? Well, that's up to you. It was cold, biting weather, and Scrooge sat in his counting house. He was determined to wring the last few hours of work out of his clerk, Bob Cratchit, before the Christmas holiday began. Bob sat shivering in his corner of the office. His fire was almost out and he ached for some warmth. He longed for the clock to strike six, the signal that he could finally go home. For tomorrow was Christmas Day and Bob loved Christmas. But as he looked up at the hands of the clock, they seemed to go slower and slower. Bob put a piece of coal into the fire and immediately began to feel warmer. Scrooge glared at him. But Bob was writing in his ledger as though nothing had happened. Luckily, at that very moment, the door swung open and in walked the old man's nephew, Fred. Merry Christmas, Uncle, cried Fred cheerily. I've come to invite you to Christmas dinner. Scrooge was having none of it. Bah humbug, came the sour reply. But Fred wasn't put off so easily, and he promised his uncle that if he changed his mind, the invitation would remain open. With that he left, wishing Bob Cratchit a Merry Christmas on the way. And a Merry Christmas to you too, called Bob with a cheery smile. 